Okay, guys, it's Zero here for my first uh, Let's Play. And I will be doing a Let's Play of Shawnee and Jump All-Stars. Okay. Uh, gotta f now, I have to play this on an emulator because, unfortunately, they never released it in uh, America. If they had, I'd be playing it on a Game Boy or something, and I'd, I'd be enjoying every minute of it. But unfortunately, they did not. So, kind of get stuck with the emulator. Which, to be honest, I'm probably going to get flagged or something for copyright because I'm not doing this on the game. But, you know, that's just people and their, you know, rules. If I do get flagged, then I'll stop making the video. And, you know, everything will just kind of end. Anyway, so, I am going to start the game tutorial clear okay my only objective is to clear the stage awesome uh oh crud i don't know anything about this wow um hopefully they explain this in the tutorial cuz th this is literally me just now opening this up i mean i've i've gone through and decided hey i want to do a let's play of this so Okay, let's start reading. Arr, I can sense your determination. You are the only person who can save this universe from catastrophe. I am Jump's protector, Jump Pirate. I've recruited you because of your cunning and strength. At this very moment, we are dealing with an emergency in space. You must travel through this portal. What portal? The planets known to us for ages have been through... Strew, strewn, whatever. Throughout the universe, by a dastardly foe. Please do all you can to save the J heroes who have been ensealed as comas. Next, move toward the center of the galaxy, where the great evil lies sleeping. Along the way, you meet some J heroes who have been deceived by this great evil. You might even have to fight them. To get to the heart of the matter. Okay, this is a lot of reading. But then against the tutorial, whatever. If you use your burning passion, they'll gain clarity and even lend their services to you. What the heck? Okay. With everyone's knowledge and power, we might be able to save this world. It's all up to you. Arr. First, I'll have to teach you about fundamental fighting here on Earth. You have two legs, right? By pressing the back and forward on the directional pad. Let's do it fast. Press it two times in a row. Let's dash. Jump. Gypsy jump. If you press A once again in midair, you are able to jump again. Holy double jump, J-Hero. And whenever you want to descend, press down on the directional pad and then... And the A button at the same time. Oh, this is amazing. Now, by practicing, try moving around on the stage. Don't use your C legs. I'll tell you when you've had enough. Ha, ah, C legs. I'm playing as Luffy. Yeah, whatever. Oh, crud. How do I... Okay, so, um, very simple game. It looks fun. Ha! Ah! Finished. What's next? Have any trouble moving around? I didn't think so. You should know how to move by now. Now for the fun part. The attack system. The B and Y buttons are used for regular attacks, and X button is pushed for several, I mean, for special moves. Okay, correct, I messed that one up. Okay, now, not enough for you, Scallywag. You can combine these buttons with the D-pad to do various techniques. And do even, and don't even think about oh, button mashing. Have a little more pride in your work. Ah, crud, but I love button mashing on Soul Calibur. I'll give you a better explanation later, but for now, as you can see, there is a red... <coughs> Sorry about my cough. Red coma. I think that's coma. 
which I want you to try to attack however you want wait however you want you'll pass this test if you KO him by the way if you see the enemy turning black and white it means they are weakened don't hesitate fired yeah take that okay that was a special not what I wanted to do I need to get my keyboard set up better because this is really freaking difficult KO! Yay! I KO'd you! Why did he turn into a green nerd? I've nearly said my piece today. The last topic is the terminal viewpoint. <coughs> there be your yellow gauge. It's your J-Soul. Um, okay, excuse that little thing that popped up. Stupid school computer. Okay. There be your yellow gauge. It's your j -Soul. Soul, when you take damage, it goes down. Did you see coma red become black and white? That was because it has has been depleted of its J soul. You need power to use a special move. This is the skill spirit. This number indicates the number of times you can use special techniques. Ah, <coughs> oh, crud, cough. Ah, <coughs> oh, crud. Sorry guys, those numbers, that is your time left in the battle. When the counter reaches zero, the battle ends. Sometimes you'll see this scribble. This symbol means there is no time limit. There are, are quite a lot of things presented here, but and I have faith that you will remember all of them. Even if you're in the middle of a furious battle. Well, matey, I guess that'd be enough of wait, coverage for the basics. In the next stage, I'll teach you more about attacking. Till next time, mate! Okay, um, so I'm going to continue to the next stage just to see if I can actually, if I have enough time to do the next stage, because I'm probably going to only keep these about ten minutes, maybe a little bit longer every once in a while, but for now, I'll just stick with a uh, general amount of time. Okay, it's another tutorial. Please let this be short. I'll try and I'll probably just try and read them really fast, so I'll stop with my funny voice. Please tell me I'm Naruto this time. I don't want to be Luffy. I don't like Luffy. Oh, you're kidding. I have to be Luffy. Ugh. Uh, I don't like Luffy. I mean, and it's mainly because One Piece was just a horrible... Like, I tried to watch the TV show, and I watched an English dub, which was a horrible idea, but, you know, it's it's all I kind of had to do. And um, so it kind of ruined the show for me, so I never really got back into it. And otherwise, all the concepts were kind of awkward and odd to me. It's about time you showed your face. Now let's get started. You'll be learning all there is to know about attacking. We'll start simple for you. Regular attacks come first. Press the B button for weak attacks. Press the Y button for strong attacks. That's more... Wait, there's more to it than that. A strong attack will do more damage, but leave you open to uh, getting hit. A weak attack won't leave you as open, but it won't do as much damage. You must choose your attacks wisely. You can combine those attacks by pressing on the D-pad to unleash techniques and combos. Press the directional but directional pad towards your opponent while attacking to hit them with a lunging attack. Whatever. Okay. <coughs> oh, crud. Wrong button. That's that's why that was. Yeah. Okay. At least, at least Luffy's got some, you know, decent uh, distance attacks. Um, so, uh, I'll probably work on this more if you are subscribed to Zero Speaks. 
you would know that I am planning to do an otaku week, which more than likely means I'm going to probably be playing this. Um, and some other games, such as the ones mentioned on Zero Speaks, like Sengoku Basara, maybe some Soul Cal. I mean, I consider Soul Cal to be an anime style of game, but that's just me. Do you remember your other attack? Besides weak and strong, they can uh, also deplete your... Uh, da, 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 da. Or that'd be special move, blah, 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 blah. Yes, I can use a special move, uh, blah, blah. Okay, KO the green coma. I KO'd my green coma. And now it's back to a red coma. Did you use your special move? I can't think of any... Okay, this is all just basic tutorial bowl. Yay! Finished! Woo! And with just enough time to spare. So, this was Zero, and I am out. Thank you.